Hey, what's up everyone? This is Ayah Dawan. And this is Ito. Uh, welcome to our video. I found this on the internet. Look, this is the uh, L scooter. Uh, I don't know. I think it looks kind of fun. What do you think? Yeah, me too. It looks kind of fun too. Right. Why don't we get one? Yeah. And, and test it, huh? Yeah. Okay. So let's go for it. So this is the Anderson e scooter 1000 uh, It comes with a pretty nice box uh, So let's uh, do some unboxing and find out what's inside So before we open the box, uh, this is how or what it says So what's inside is we have e scooter, we have charger and we have user manual I see a user manual here next one we have this uh, I think this is a charging unit and uh, some uh, handle grip and the main thing or the e-scooter so let's, let's take it out there you go it's around 8 kilograms as, as per uh, the specification so See if we have something left. Nope. And take out the mic. Right, so now we're going to make the bike. It should be like this. Yep. There you go. We even have a, a small jack stand here, just like the real motorcycle. So we are attaching the handlebar Right, perfect! As you can see we have uh, three set settings for the, uh, the height of this uh, handlebar So I think uh, what we need to do is just to press this yeah, exactly And then uh, yeah. I think this would be the, uh, the highest settings for the handlebar So the next thing we do is according to the manual we need to charge uh, this scooter for the first time for about four hours so let's do it so now the battery is full let's take it for a ride right so this is how it works so we have the power button here so basically if we press this uh, about three seconds it will turn on the scooter uh, we have the accelerator pedal here so if we press it down then it will accelerate the bike we have two brakes here so this is the front brake so if we press it it will brake and then the other one is the the rear brake which is this one basically if you press this then it will uh, brake the bike as well This is our first experience with electric moped or scooter and so far we have been uh, really happy with this yeah it's really easy to use uh, no problem at all getting used to it uh, it has nice features such as the built-in headlamps as well as the rear uh, brake light um, uh, nice looking as well 
actually what I like the most of this uh, bike is it can be folded so when it's folded it's very easy to take it with me put it in the back of my car or even take it uh, with me on the bus so it really helps my mobility however there are several things I would like to mention about this bike uh, first uh, of all is uh, the front bra uh, brake I don't think it's uh, really strong enough in many cases I need to rely heavily on the rear brake to stop it and the other thing is that uh, this uh, moped can easily uh, run out of torque or power in an inclination maybe because this is the smallest model uh, in the Anderson line so if you are going to use it in the uh, hilly uh, terrain or environment then I would really recommend you to get something bigger than this but then otherwise if you're going to use it in a flat ground then this would be perfect especially considering its mobility so that was my thoughts or review of this Anderson e-scooter 1000 I really hope that this video would be useful for you or maybe for someone who is thinking of getting one uh, if you like this video then please uh, hit that like button you can also uh, put your comments down there as well and I will see you again on my other review stay tuned